Hello, my name is Michael Wiles, and welcome to part two of my Cognex Easy Builder walkthrough video series. Now that we've set up from the first video our locate part, we are now locating a specific feature of the part. So now we can define that we are seeing this part or not. What we can further do is uh, define with inspect part additional features on the, the view of the camera. So what we're going to set up here is I'm going to use a measurement tool. It's just a selecting a distance and angle or an area and just do a basic distance measurement here. And now you have your highlight around your part. These are the acceptable uh, locations where you can select an edge that the camera is registering. So I'm going to select it straight across. Uh, as from the first video, I had defined this as 45 millimeters. Um, so I should be seeing something pretty similar here. Up in our palette we see right now it's reading 44.976 millimeters. Pretty close. Uh, you can also see that this distance measurement is linked in the palette here to edge 1 and edge 2, which are these uh, highlighted edges that I had selected. Uh, so anytime you have uh, multiple things you've selected for uh, an inspect tool, uh, you're going to see those links up here as well. Um, what we also have here for it is we can set our acceptable uh, range limits of the measurement. So right now it's allowing a, let's see, a two and change, two and a quarter um, either way on this measurement. And you can adjust that if you need tighter tolerances for what's actually acceptable. So now that's pretty tight. Uh, I'm going to leave it just right here for now. and. Now that we have that, you can save your job, and we're going to run this job. Again, we come down here to our, all of our results. We're still seeing if we're passing or not on that pattern. And now we also have those edges and the distance that we'll be checking for a pass or fail. Once we go online, now it's going to be if it can see those or not. And every time it comes out of that, and if we manipulate it, just tilting it, moving it around, if it loses any of those edges and it can't get that distance measurement, then it's going to uh, throw a fail. Thank you.